number eight. What? Not in 24. Josh Allen. And now the first thing that you see when you press start is, you got the game? Well, you didn't get the game. You need to get the game. What the fuck is this? Every fucking time you fire up the fucking game, it's a fucking advertisement for Ultimate Team. You need to pay us more money. The very first screen is more money, Joe. Fucking Madden 24. Ah! Fuck me, EA. Fuck me, EA. Madden 24. An abusive relationship that they literally cannot quit. I haven't seen a single overall in anybody yet. I'm kind of excited on first pack. Good. Low key, I'm sad to see training come back. I think the whole idea of upgrading players and having to pay to put abilities on them is total is fucking horseshit. Plus, that whole system's clunky and slow, but whatever. We got an A4 plus. I think the whole idea of upgrading players and having to pay to put abilities on them is total is fucking horseshit. It's fucking horseshit. But whatever. We got an A4 plus. It's A4 on the top. Just take the plus away. You're gonna bend me over. At least give me a glass of wine first. Maybe take me out to dinner. Cause I like to be wined and dined before you fuck me, EA! An hour and ten minutes is the length of our angry review for Madden 24 last year. Things just keep getting worse and worse as the ease of difficulty should supposedly be lowering every year as you literally have everything built for you that you're using over and over. That's pretty phenomenal right there. It actually gave me chills just to hear you say that because immortality forever and ever. When you look in the record books, you'll see this team, you'll see their picture, that your, your name will be a part of it. That's got to be an incredible feeling because it's been a long journey to get there, and now they get a chance to enjoy it. This game continues to be a fucking mess on this engine. A huge platform for gambling addicts. Unlock incredible rewards, you fucking pay pig. Complete objectives by opening your wallet and making your team even more exclusive and better than the last idiot who didn't spend enough money. When the season resets, you'll get nothing. Absolutely nothing. Complete bullshit microtransactions. No! Purchase recommended for... No! <laughs> you can buy celebrations in fucking Madden regular season. I have to spend $5 so I can do this. On a game that runs like shit on PC and consoles. Game is hitching, Joe. What do you want me to do? Well, they just I'm not going to get 2,000 yards when I'm throwing like this. Uh, they uh, just implemented uh, feed uh, sense and uh, uh, the old new gen stuff for PC. So it's going to take some time. Uh, 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 uh. Are you fucking... Uh, PC is garbage. We are losing features and modes and not having them replaced with anything worth a damn. What the fuck? My eyes are bleeding. This is football now. Feels like an empty club. Sad. <laughs> That's right. Well, let's get out of here. <laughs> We had one drink. That sausage fest, man. Let's one drink. Let's get out of here. Yeah. Yeah. But hey, we got slightly better team animations this year. Is everything forgiven, right? Right? No! They're fucking using legacy code that they have no idea of what fucking code it or made, and they're fucking they're tacking onto it, and pieces are breaking. This code is so fucking old. It needs to be thrown out. God damn it. Instead, it's all about milking the NFL fans for all their fucking worth by being the only game in town year after year with this unjust monopoly. Enhancements to foundational football in key aspects of gameplay increase the authenticity of every play. The result is a better assessment of the playing field and defensive threats by ball carrier AI and more appropriate movement through the chaos of a play. Some of the worst looking customization options ever, guy. 
the picture is 